Hey guys, welcome back to another video on Scylla Stuff and Things. Today, we are gonna make our first Easter treat of the season. So come along and let's get cooking. For this recipe, you need three simple ingredients. All you have to get, Rice Krispie Treats, Peeps, and butter. That's it. We are gonna be making Rice Krispie Treat Peeps <laughs> Easter something. I don't even know what to call it, but super simple. I actually saw it on a Facebook video. No one was mentioned, so I don't know where it came from, but it's all over the place. So I'm sorry, I can't tell you who the originator is, but just enjoy. While we get these ready in our pan, we're gonna go ahead and preheat our oven 350 degrees. And that's that simple. So you're gonna get a baking dish of your choice. You could also get a throwaway dish. Maybe you're going to an Easter event, but we're just gonna take our peeps, line them up, and you have to have a mixture of colors for the peeps. And we're just going to do multicolor, you know? There's really no rules. It's kind of how you wanna do it. Peeps are probably the most controversial candy of all time, like any holiday, like anything. Peeps is controversial. So let me know, are you a fan or not? Cause I don't feel like there's any in between. It's like you either love them or hate them. <laughs> we are personally not a Peeps fan, but for right now, this is a marshmallow. So we're just thinking of it as a marshmallow dish with the Rice Krispies. So it works out fine. This will be great to take to your family parties for Easter, have for the kids, maybe a school party, anything like that. You could be the Rice Krispie Treat mom for that day. They will love you for it, I promise. Okay, once you have all your peeps in the bottom of your pan, next up we have our Rice Krispie Treats. I'm not measuring it out, I'm just going to pour it over the marshmallows, the peeps, until we kinda, till they're just like peeping out the top, you know? <laughs> because you're gonna do a second layer of this. Can you believe that? I don't know who's gonna eat this. I don't know if we'll even eat it. We'll have to give it to a neighbor. Okay, so we've got our layer of Rice Krispies. Now we're gonna go back in, do some more peeps. Got your peeps, layer with your Rice Krispies. Okay. Are you guys freaking out? So fun fact, I don't like sticky and peeps are sticky when you pull them apart. It's stressing me out a little bit. <laughs> Can you relate? Then we're gonna take our butter. We're just gonna put like eight tablespoons on top of our mixture here. You know, this is gonna be fun. Ace is stressing, I can tell. You're just gonna put it right on top. It's not gonna be like normal Rice Krispie Treats, guys. It's a little bit different, okay? I feel like it's gonna be way sweeter. I don't know, this might be a fail. We'll see. <laughs> I don't know that we've ever had a fail on our channel. I feel like this could end up like that outfit that you see on a mannequin and you're like, that is so cute. And then you go try it on, you're like, oh my gosh, that's not cute at all. You know what I'm talking about? This could end up like that. It looked so easy and so cute when I saw it on Facebook. I don't know. <laughs> you have to hang around. We're gonna throw this in our oven for eight minutes. That's it. Just eight minutes on 350 degrees. Fingers crossed that it works. Oh my goodness. So it's out. From what I saw in the video, you just kind of mix it up. I, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know that I did enough butter. Let's see. Is it gonna be a fail? I'm like, I told Ace I'm stirring this and little peep eyeballs are staring at me like, don't, don't <laughs> stir me away. Okay, it's working. It's working really well. I'm super impressed. You could make it the night before Easter and leave it out for the Easter Bunny. Do you guys leave things out for the Easter Bunny? Like Santa? We're gonna add sprinkles because why not? Oh my gosh. So cute. You could get little Easter Bunny sprinkles or something like that. 
if you wanted to add it to it. We did it. I think it turned out super cute. If you had more peeps, you could like put them all over, but I don't think you need any more than that. The question is, does it taste good for us non-peep eaters? So we're gonna let it cool. We'll come back later when Abby gets home and try it out for you. Summer, hmm. do you like peeps? I don't like peeps. I don't either. <laughs> Me either. <laughs> Abby, do you like peeps? I don't think she does. I think she spit them out. Uh -huh. It's probably time. a texture thing. Yeah. You think? I mean, or That's a gross fair. thing. Or Who gross? does <laughs> like peeps? Like. I don't, I've never met anyone that actually liked peeps. I feel like I have, and I don't want to hurt anybody's feelings, but you've got to be lying if you do. <laughs> <laughs> Abby, come here, try this. <laughs> Look. Rice Krispies fart. Yeah. <laughs> what do you think? Here you go, son. Thanks. Try it out. Mm. Is it good? Do you like it? <laughs> She's like, should I? Mmm. It doesn't taste like a peep, right? No. Oh. It's a sensory aspect yeah. of it all. Yeah. It's like redemption for the peeps. <laughs> okay, I think we have a winner. Uh -huh. Guys, thanks so much for hanging out with us today. I hope you enjoyed the video. If so, give us a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't done so, and we will see you next time. Bye guys.